doll modeling. This is both a sculpture and a delicacy. The doll flower can still bloom in the cold winter. The art of doll flower modeling is popular in northern China, closely related to the diet and the customs of the local people. In ancient China, people modeled the doll into shapes of animals and flowers to worship ancestors and gods in place of real animals. Later, doll sculpture has been varied, with both edible and ornamental functions. Gradually, they played a more important role in traditional festivals and weddings. The sculptures can be as heavy as 2 kilos or as small as 3 inches. The style is close to people's life. Making doll sculptures in lotus, peach, and other festive shapes is a custom during the Spring Festival in many regions. Some of the doll sculptures will be transformed into different roles of Peking Opera. Sheng, Dan, Jin, Chou. The tools for doll modeling also come from life. Owls, combs, and other utensils can be used to press out points and lines, help create exquisite design. As the local customs are different, doll modeling has regional characteristics. For example, Huangling style has complex craftsmanship and exquisite production. Xinjiang style is simple and elegant, like freehand sketches. Langzhuang style maintains a strong local flavor. Folk artists in northern China depict the home and life they love with a pair of skillful hands. <laughs>